Um, so we're really excited to be sharing the Scotia Half Bank Half Marathon experience, uh, and we're going to show you the before, the during, and the after uh, over a five-day series. So you can see the blow by blow and how it all kind of comes together. It's it's quite a lot of prep. Uh, and then during the race, there's a lot going on, and we want to kind of break that down for you. And then afterwards, you've got to be just as careful as before. So we thought it would be really in insightful to see everything, uh, and uh, we're, we're happy to share that with you. Yeah, that's why we're doing it in a five-day thing. So today is day one. So our race is actually in two days, but because today we actually have to go pick up our race kit, and I think there might be an expo. We'll find out in this video in a couple minutes. <laughs> and... Uh, uh, we're just going to talk about what we do two days leading up to the race, then the day before, then the day of. We're actually going to film parts of the race. We're not going to put it in this video though, because that's going to be a longer video about like what we did during the race, because that's a fun video. Because this is more like a prep and like what we do after, recovery run, do we like do yoga, do we sleep, what do we eat, and what do we eat before the day before. Like so, there's a whole bunch of things that we, we want to talk about, because it's like no one ever really talks about it, like a one thing. Yeah. So might as well just do that. Together. Yeah. So you know. When you do your next race, what to do? What to do? If it's your first one, especially, we want to be there for you, support you. We are there for you, FTM runners and non-FTM runners. If you're watching this, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Anybody. anybody runners, <laughs> anybody runner. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's All right. go for a run. Anyway, let's, let's take a look. See what we did today. So that when I put them on my wall, Chase Ross. All right. So you just saw uh, us at the expo. It was a very small expo. Yeah. Us picking up our Tiny. race kits. Um, we're gonna show you the race stuff. Like we didn't. I just like I have my bib here, and we're gonna show all of this. Like what we do with it later. Hmm. Um, for, like tomorrow. <laughs> Um, but the real important thing is that we got our shirts made. Ooh, yeah. It's, you can't really see what mine says, but it says FTM Runners. I'll come closer. <laughs> so, yeah, it says, can you see? Yeah, there you go. It says hashtag FTM Runners. Um, we did it in these colors. Why? Because we're fabulous. Yeah. And we want to stick out. We wanted some people pay attention to pink. I, other people pay attention to yellow, and we just wanted to, you know, raise awareness. Uh, and we'll probably answer hopefully a lot of questions. <laughs> like, what's FTM? First time moms. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Move on. This is what we're eating. Hey folks. So this is what we're eating. This is a classic carbo loading uh, pasta dinner. Let me zoom in on that. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> and what I like is whole wheat. Uh, there's also spinach whole wheat, so you can make it really healthy. And then I've just got a like a, a marinara sauce. Uh, uh, with spinach in it as well, and then it's just a lovely salad. Check this out. It's, it's summer, so we've got some fruits in there. Um, but you can also do pizza as well. Anything with tomato sauce, essentially, because it has lipo lipopene or whatever it's in, in there, um, which helps with race prep uh, and gets you all ready. Uh, and this will go through your system. Just FYI, warning. <laughs> so you don't, you don't have to poop during the race, is that what you're trying to say? Because well, hashtag fiber? <laughs> You, you'll relieve yourself before the race, which is a good thing, uh, and then you're set to go. And then this will provide a lot of good fuel uh, during the race that'll sustain you, especially for long distance races. So, yeah. yeah. I usually have some turmeric rice with uh, potato stew, but I'm not trying anything new. Don't worry, because that's the rule. Don't try anything new. I usually, I'm eating a burrito bowl. It looks really weird on the camera because of like the, it's pretty intense. That's like guac that I made. It kind of looks good. There's a lot, there's a shit ton of rice under there. That's like where it's all my deep. carbs of are and then like veggies because hashtag vegan. So that's what I'm going to be eating like all night. And I uh, just want to show you the beautiful view that we have. This is literally the view that we have. Anyways, so this is it for tonight, I think. Right? See ya. Yeah. So um, we're going to show you our race kit right before we go to sleep and what time we go to bed. But for now, let's just enjoy this beautiful feast, yeah? Uh, people are going to wonder why are there three places but two people? <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so these are our clothes for tomorrow. Laid them out because we're corny like that so that we can take a picture on Instagram and get lots of likes <laughs> so that people know that we're doing this. Um, wake up at 5 o'clock in the morning, yet look how nice it is right now. I have to go to bed. It's like 8 What time is it? 8.30? Anyone? 8.38. 8.38. For fuck's sake, it's, 8, it's 8.40 and I have to go to bed. We all have to go to bed. 
Uh, there's people on the beach enjoying life. Anyways, we'll see you tomorrow. I'm like, I've been up for like an hour. What time is it? <laughs> I'm the one who just woke up, okay? <laughs> You're spoopy. It's 5.30, but it's like super nice out. It's like a regular day. Like, look, if you like, can I like look? Okay, well, you can't fucking see outside apparently. The sun's like, not for you today. Um, yeah, so we have our stuff. We just ate, oh yeah, breakfast. Uh, oh, yeah. What'd you eat? I don't know. You just ate it. Mm-hmm. It's gone now. Okay. It I, was some sort of like fruit mushy thing. Because basically I can't eat anything before a race. So this is actually hashtag. Don't follow warning. that. Trigger <laughs> warning. Don't follow his advice. I, I eat like fake veggie wieners. Fake veggie. No, that would be meat. I eat ve veggie wieners. Small, like breakfast links. Oh. With some grapes and a smoothie. Probably shouldn't have that big of a smoothie. But that's snulch for here. I actually never finish it anyway. So, um, yeah, we're going to like. Get ready. Get we ready. Have, like, we, we, have, we, we have like an hour to get ready, so I, I, I'm going to have to go fast because I take a long time to get ready. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not kidding. Anyways, um, like, well, you'll see our outfits. We'll do that. We'll, we'll show you our outfits. <laughs> you look so awake. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like people were like, you should make a video of you getting ready. <laughs> Just in that voice. Oh, it's so hot for spandex though. I know. I have to though because if I wear this without actual like something mm. touching my junk, yeah. I feel open. <laughs> Not like that! Calm down! You're disgusting. That's where your mind goes. Do you have this recording? Oh yeah, whoops, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> The sun is so, so bright. low, it's just like the midriff stuff. It's like the midriff stuff, the beam. Oh, you want to talk about packing? While I'm getting ready? Packing. I mean, it's on, might as well. Well, while I do that, you just talk. You just talk. I'll just do stuff. Uh, talk about packing? I mean, like, you could sit down, though, if you want. <laughs> I'm only. Wait, did the eyes go like this? I want to make sure it's on point. Is this the frog? Yeah. Perfect, the frog. Okay, it'll be on my left nip. Move. <laughs> <laughs> That's all that space. This is gonna come off the instant he starts sweating. Um, actually, they usually say, actually, these are kind of cheap. Product placement. Anyways, um, I'm gonna get ready and he's gonna talk to you about packing. Okay, so. Trigger when morning. <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, I thought this was another. Uh, what is like, this? Um, this ain't no Elmo! Okay, sorry, it's, it's, it's Sesame Street. It's Muppets, okay? Oh, it's Muppets? I thought well, it was Sesame Street. Sesame Street, uh, so Muppets. You lied. It's like. It's all these different ones. Basically, Chafing, by the way. Yeah, yeah you should. <laughs> okay, you. For those of you who take tea, if you uh, have band aids that you apply to your injection shots area, you can use those for your nips. If you're post op, there we go. Um, that's my <laughs> plug. This band aid is too small for this nip. <laughs> uh, so when I, when I'm training, I uh, well I pack all the time, uh, but particularly I feel the need to pack when I'm running uh, with race shorts, or shorts that are a little bit smaller. Um, these, these guys are very short compared to the rest of my legs. Uh, and so that's when I notice that, uh, uh, especially on cis guys, there's more junk that shows at that point. So Junk in your trunk. Yeah, so I uh, pack as well. But uh, in order to do that, I can't just throw them into very loose fitting um, underwear that are part of these shorts, so I wear an extra pair of underwear underneath to allow me to pack with security so it doesn't flop about <laughs> during the race. <laughs> uh, or, yeah. Wait, so what are you wearing under there? I'm wearing a pair of underwear underneath. Oh, uh, America. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> well, game Game Anyways, so I feel confident and ready to Run. <laughs> Product placement. <laughs> Trigger warning. A rainbow. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, more confidence if you um, double up. But as a result, like today, it's gonna be really <laughs> hot, and it's not gonna be a lot of fun. But uh, that's the price of packing, right? Sweatzilla over here. Mm -hmm. And then you put spandex on for different reasons. I do. Yeah. So. Um. So, I, <laughs> I put on spent, which is like different, like it's like, like it, <laughs> it's just, it's like a spandex thing and then I put shorts because um, the shorts do have like a built-in underwear, but I don't like when it touches my junk because I feel too free, <laughs> like this, exactly like that. It's a trigger warning, for real. Um, so the spandex just kind of like, mm, because I can't pack with the easy pee 
while I run anymore um, because it's the summer and I don't have like 19 layers on my junk and it just flops around. I'm like, I ain't losing this. Yeah. But I think I'm going to use his thing. It does stay secure. I'll use your thing though. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's get ready <clears throat> and uh, let's get loose. Have some fun. Let's get going. Stop. Now, the song cut and now the song oh, cut yeah. again. Spoopy, we're, we're, we're starting. We're okay. starting. Now we're about to start. We cross. What a good looking bunch you are, I'll tell you. What a good looking bunch. Check it out. <laughs> if your phone ah. falls, we're so fucked. <laughs> we are. Okay, it's good. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Look at us go. Ah. I'm so hot. Yeah, I'm sweaty. <laughs> On the shade. I know. Oh. Thank God. Oh, baby. Look at this guy overheat. <laughs> overheat? Look at this guy overheating. So, so how are you guys? <laughs> we're doing well. We're at 14.5. Uh, okay. Seven, seven left. So we're approaching, well, uh, we've got maybe another 2K to the Broad Street Bridge. Less, and then I'm taking off my shirt. Yeah, even though know, it sounds like right at me, I know, and there's some sunscreen on my oh, puppy. <laughs> hey, that feel when I don't feel the sunburn on my feet, though. Oh. It's like blisters. Bless. Blusters. <laughs> Bluster. I feel like you just took a picture of 18. I don't know where we are anymore. I'm delirious. That's right. We're keeping it up. Fucking God, if there's no Last water, two I'm fucking kill K. Somebody. Two oh, fucking K of this fucking oh, race. Chase, how do you feel? Die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to half marathons. <laughs> I, I already signed up for the next one. Hey! <laughs> hey! We did it. I don't know. I feel like we should have shown you to stretch. We just finished. We're stretching. We'll do a video later. I'm too tired. <laughs> Unless you want to talk. It's all about this. I'm like so crooked. About the blame. Okay, it hurts my arm. We'll, we'll talk about this later. <laughs> so I know this is day four and the day after the race, and we're supposed to make a video about us recovering, but I'm so tired. Um, we were supposed to do yoga. I actually always do yoga after a race, but I didn't. Um, I felt really great during the day, no pain. Thighs hurt a little bit, but now I'm like exhausted. It's like 10.30 at night. So we are gonna talk more about these things tomorrow when we're doing a recovery run. Um, and that'll complete the five days of this, of this stuff, which is great. Uh, this is, uh, oh, day five. five. Day five. Five. I can't even put five up, but there you go. Five. Chase day is five. doing it for us. Um, so this is our recovery run. Yeah. We're gonna do it together for the first, like, one k, <laughs> And then he's gonna go all fast and shit, because I'm a slow bitch. But, no. Oh my God, it feels so good to run after a uh, half marathon. I know. Like, I feel so good running right it's now. It's pretty easy. Also, hey? hello, we're topless. <laughs> we're running That's in the nude. Ah, look at this. This is like my first nude run. Full nude run. Pra I'm not nude. <laughs> Blessed. <laughs> uh, this is an important thing to go slow. Yeah. After a race. Yeah, especially because yesterday we didn't do any yoga. Yeah. Which is not a good thing to do. You want to do a lot of stretching. Because half marathons are stressful on your system. Yeah. And we're probably gonna end up crashing into some people right now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the beach. Yeah. We are going to a stretching video tomorrow. Where what? Stretching video tomorrow? Yeah. On that's, the beach. Uh, with dynamic stretching as well. Yes, because you can't important. stretch before a run. Like, yeah, normal stretching. Yeah, because your muscles are all cold. Yeah, and after this run, we are going to. We're doing some food. We're going to make a video about uh, the final days of prep. Because this is it, right? Yeah. <laughs> is this hurting your hand? No. Okay, I we'll can see run. After, after the run. Bye. Speed away, my love. Oh my goodness. So we finished the run, the recovery run. It was awesome. It was amazing. I felt uh, really strong. It was beautiful to see the sunset, oh. and then now it's dark out, and there was people. Yeah, silhouettes. I, I, with my shirt off the whole time, it was my first like full run without a shirt. That's awesome. Yeah, it was great. And, and my best 5K. Mm. Mm. I'm, ugh. Mm. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. Be Anyways. proud.
B. B. But that's the thing, you see, it's colder now. So if it was this temperature I know. during the race, I literally probably could have done 215. I for real, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm not even tired after that, and I didn't even have water after 5K. Usually I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> oh anyway, so I hope you enjoyed our five days of prep, race prep. Well, um, race pre, during, and post. Yeah, I'm calling it five-day race prep, just because... And then... Hi, uh, co semi no colon before during after race continuum yeah so it's important to have a recovery yeah. day a recovery run and now I'm like so pumped my legs didn't even hurt like yeah. usually and after it's, it's good. important uh, to do it really slowly because some people are very tempted if they don't feel any pain to go really fast that's myself included I just did that <laughs> I know right but anyways uh, because your body is still recuperating even if you can't feel it Think if some of you have done po uh, uh, surgery, top surgery, and you felt fine and you wanted to go do back flips, but you're not supposed to, do this the same thing. Yeah. Now I feel bad. I probably shouldn't have done that that fast. I mean, I feel good. I listened to my body. If I felt like I was going to die, I would have stopped. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Or I would have went slower. Yeah. Yeah. Like, at some parts, I did go slow. Like, if you look at my thing, but... Well, and we, during the race, we went slowly for different reasons. Yes, because it was way too hot. Out of, I didn't want to like die. You had the capacity to run faster, yeah. but because of the heat, you couldn't, right? I didn't so want to pass out. That's a different situation. Yeah, although I'm like sweaty like fuck right now, but I'm always sweaty. Anyways, thank you for watching. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed our... I mean, obviously, there's things that we could have improved on and added during this, cool. this race prep, but... There's so much involved in racing, yeah. so we just scratched the surface. Oh, yeah. Every time. Do you know how many other races I have coming up? But Actually, July is like the first month of no race. I have anxiety anyways. <laughs> what were you saying? They're there. Uh, we're going to do a video about stretching because a lot of you have been asking about that. Yeah. And that's really important um, before, during, and after, all that good stuff. So it's yeah. all about dynamic stretches. It's a tease. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we made a video about binding and breathing because I know a lot of people have been asking about that. So we're going to post that in the next couple of days. Yeah. Thank you for watching, and yeah. if you have any suggestions for the next time I do a race, like, I know somebody wanted me to go pull the entire race, that would kind of hurt my arms, but maybe in the future. <laughs> well, and it might not be that interesting. Yeah, it's it's two hours, you know that, right? Like, it's two it, hours of running. There's a lot of breathing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, we gave you the Coles notes, which is more interesting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Have a swell. Yeah. Think of me. Don't forget to watch the full race footage that we put in another video. I'll annotate it on Kai's face. Because blessed. Alright, think of me. Have a swell. Okay. Happy bye. trails. Oh, bye. And we're about to make a whole bunch of videos for you. So you can understand the importance and how to run. The importance and how to run. Yeah. I like it. <laughs>